Hi there, and welcome. Terence Howard, what a roller coaster journey he's had in Hollywood. This man's talent has been evident for a long time, but along the way, he's faced his fair share of challenges. You know those performers who just captivate you at every turn? That's Howard. He burst onto the scene with a raw energy that was magnetic, people couldn't take their eyes off him. Born on March 11 th, 1969, in Chicago, Illinois, Terence Howard's upbringing was marked by turmoil and adversity. Even after moving to Cleveland, Ohio, to escape abuse stemming from his father's actions, trouble followed. The infamous centerline killing cast a shadow over his family, and Tyrone's imprisonment led Terence to seek solace in Los Angeles under the care of his great-grandmother. Life in Los Angeles introduced Howard to the allure of gang life. Seeking camaraderie and security, he joined the Mansfield Criminal Crips. However, while it offered a sense of belonging, it also exposed him to the dangers of street life, including violence and incarceration. Despite the allure of the streets, Howard had an epiphany when faced with the consequences of his choices. He began to question his path, paving the way for a determined effort to break free from the cycle of violence. Howard sought alternative paths for growth, turning to education, self-reflection, and creative outlets. Inspired by his grandmother's acting background, he pursued entertainment with unwavering determination. His talent soon garnered attention, landing him roles in television shows and films throughout the 90s, culminating in a breakthrough role in The Best Man. Early on, he showcased his versatility, excelling in supporting roles as well as leading ones. However, behind the scenes, it was tumultuous. He seemed to always be at odds with someone, whether it was co-stars, directors, or even the law. Yet, despite the drama, Howard persevered, continually pushing forward and taking on challenging roles. When he reached his peak, it was something extraordinary. Blockbusters, indie films he was everywhere, loved by critics and adored by fans. Still, Hollywood is a fickle place, and just when things seemed bright, setbacks occurred. Projects fell through, opportunities vanished, and he faced false rumors and challenges to manage his career. Howard's journey to fame began on the bustling streets of New York City, where a casting director recognized his raw talent. This led to breakthrough performances on television in the mid-90s, notably as Jackie Jackson in The Jacksons, an American dream and appearances in shows like Living Single and NYPD Blue. His lead role in Sparks in 1996 propelled him further into the spotlight, showcasing his versatility and charm. He ventured into films in 1995, delivering standout performances in Mr. Holland's Opus and Dead Presidents, portraying complex characters with finesse. His presence extended to the music scene, with notable appearances in music videos and guest spots on various shows. However, it was his role in Hustle and Flow in 2005 that changed the game. His portrayal of a pimp-turned-rapper earned him critical acclaim, including an Academy Award nomination and a win for Best Original Song. From there, Howard's career skyrocketed with roles in acclaimed films like Ray, Crash, and The Brave One, showcasing his versatility and range. His portrayal of James Rhodes in the first Iron Man film solidified his status in mainstream cinema, while his iconic role as Lucius Lyon in Empire captivated audiences on the small screen. Yet, Howard's talents extended beyond acting, he ventured into music, releasing his debut album Shine through it in 2008. In December 2022, Howard announced his retirement from acting, 
leaving behind a legacy that speaks to talent and perseverance and leaving an indelible mark on the entertainment world. However, his journey was not without its controversies and challenges. His departure from the Marvel Cinematic Universe after the first Iron Man film sparked rumors of conflicts with co-stars and studio executives. Legal battles, personal struggles, and turbulent relationships added layers of complexity to his public persona. Despite the ups and downs, Howard's legacy endures from his humble beginnings to Hollywood royalty. His journey serves as a testament to resilience, talent, and the complexities of fame. As he navigates the complexities of his personal and professional life, one thing remains certain, Terence Howard's legacy will endure for years to come. Terence Howard's journey through the labyrinth of Hollywood is akin to a roller coaster ride, replete with exhilarating highs and challenging lows. He possesses an undeniable talent that has captivated audiences for decades, yet his path has been fraught with obstacles and setbacks. Howard emerged onto the scene with a raw energy that immediately drew attention, captivating audiences with his magnetic presence. Born on April 11 th, 1969, in Chicago, Illinois, Howard's upbringing was marked by adversity and turmoil. Moving to Cleveland, Ohio, did not shield him from the tumultuous environment, as his father's actions led to upheaval, and eventually, the infamous centerline murder cast a shadow over his family. Tyrone's imprisonment prompted Terence to seek solace in Los Angeles under the care of his grandmother. Life in Los Angeles exposed Howard to the allure of street life, leading him to seek companionship and security by affiliating with the Mansfield criminal crypts. However, this decision also exposed him to the dangers of street violence and incarceration. Despite the allure of street life, Howard had an epiphany when confronted with the consequences of his choices. He began questioning his path, paving the way for a determined effort to break free from the cycle of violence. Seeking alternative avenues for growth, education, self-reflection, and creative outlets became his tools for transformation. Inspired by his grandmother's background in acting, Howard pursued entertainment with unwavering determination. His talent soon garnered attention, landing him roles in television shows and films throughout the and 90s, culminating in a breakthrough role in The Best Man. Early on, Howard showcased his versatility, excelling in supporting roles as well as leading ones. However, behind the scenes, he seemed to be in constant conflict, whether with co-stars, directors, or even the law. Despite the tumultuous nature of his journey, Howard refused to let the drama derail his progress, pushing forward and taking on challenging roles that showcased his abilities. As his career reached its zenith, Howard found himself in the spotlight, starring in blockbusters, indie films, and television series. Critics lauded him, and fans couldn't get enough. Yet, Hollywood's fickleness soon reared its head. Projects fell through, opportunities evaporated, and false rumors circulated, challenging Howard's resilience. Despite these setbacks, his journey to fame had a fortuitous beginning on the bustling streets of New York City, where a casting director recognized his raw talent, propelling him into the limelight. In the mid-90s, Howard made waves on television with standout performances in shows like The Jacksons, An American Dream and Living Single. His lead role in Sparks in 1996 catapulted him to prominence, showcasing his versatility and charm. He ventured into films in 1995, delivering standout performances in Mr. Holland's Opus and Dead Presidents solidifying his reputation as a versatile actor capable of portraying complex characters with depth and authenticity. Howard's foray into music videos, guest appearances on television shows, and his role in Hustle and Flow in 2005 marked a significant turning point in his career. 
his portrayal of a pimp-turned-rapper earned him critical acclaim along with an Academy Award nomination for Best Actor. From there, Howard's filmography expanded with notable roles in films like Winnie Mandela, Ray, and The Brave One, showcasing his ability to tackle any role with aplomb. However, it was his role as Lucius Lyon in Empire that solidified Howard's status as a household name. His portrayal of the charismatic and complex music mogul garnered widespread acclaim, earning him a Golden Globe Award. Despite his success on the small screen, Howard's talents extended beyond acting. In 2008, he released his debut album, Shine Through It, showcasing his musical prowess. In December 2022, Howard announced his retirement from acting, leaving behind a legacy that transcends humble beginnings to Hollywood royalty. His journey, marked by resilience, talent, and perseverance, serves as a testament to his enduring impact on the entertainment world. Despite facing setbacks and challenges, Howard's ability to overcome adversity and pursue his dreams serves as inspiration for aspiring artists everywhere. Yet Howard's journey has not been without its share of controversies and legal battles. His departure from the Marvel Cinematic Universe after the first Iron Man film sparked debates and legal disputes, highlighting tensions behind the scenes. Howard's reputation for being difficult to work with clashed with Marvel Studios' no-nonsense approach, ultimately leading to his replacement in subsequent films. Moreover, Howard's personal life has been a subject of public scrutiny marked by multiple marriages, divorces, and legal battles. His tumultuous relationships and legal disputes have often overshadowed his professional achievements, adding layers of complexity to his public persona. However, Howard's resilience in the face of adversity and his ability to navigate the complexities of fame and fortune speak volumes about his character. Despite the challenges he has faced, Howard remains undeterred, continuing to pursue his passions and inspiring others with his talent and determination. As he embarks on a new chapter in his life, Howard's legacy as a trailblazing actor, musician, and cultural icon will continue to endure, leaving an indelible mark on the entertainment industry for years to come.